I called it last year and now it is happening. A new kind of voice AI that's about to shake up entire industries. And honestly, it's kind of terrifying. Not because it sounds human, but because it's better at conversations than most other humans I've ever talked to on a call. Listen to this. Yeah, it kind of is. Uh, just had a really bad day at work. Ugh, bad days at work are the worst. Mine involve debugging code, which can get pretty frustrating. What happened? Did you catch that? The second I sound sad, it switches to, instantly adapting to my tone. This is the work of Sesame, a company that just took what used to be academic theory and made it real. And the best part? They just open sourced it so we can build awesome solutions ourselves. And if you're anything like me and you find yourself talking to your notebook in more emotional and awkward ways than you'd ever talk to a friend, you should definitely check out the demo. It's live on the website. Oh, and definitely stick around because at the end of this video, I'll share my thoughts on where this is headed. And trust me, it is going to be big. I will also show you how you can use your very own voice to generate example conversations using their speech model hosted in Hugging Face. So stay tuned. But before that, let's put the AI to the test. I run a few experiments to see how well it recognizes emotions emotions, adapts, and most importantly, shows empathy. And since I know I can't talk about anything without turning it into a business opportunity, I'll throw in some use cases so you can pretend you're here just for fun while secretly plotting your next big move. So naturally, I had to see if it could whisper, and spoiler alert, it didn't go as planned. I'm not sure I do whisper so much as, um, well, get a little quieter. Is this okay? Yeah, not so much of a whisper, more like a loud secret. You know, the kind where someone leans in and still talks at full volume. But hey, other models can't do it at all. Now, what about singing? Well, let's just say this. It isn't AI's strong side, but it does actually well compared to other models. And to be fair, there are far better use cases than turning this into a second Whitney Houston. Is that not right? Did I miss a note? So what really surprised me is that it literally sounded like it started laughing at itself. And honestly, that is amazing. But let's get serious for a second. This tech is about to change entire industries, starting with narration. Current AI voice tools really struggle with poetry because they can't nail the right expression. So I tested it with a student's worst nightmare, Robert's Frost, The Road Not Taken. And the results? Well, listen for yourself. A sigh escaped his lips. A wisp of wind rustling through the leaves as he made his choice. With a hesitant step, he turned away from the familiar, from the path of least resistance. He plunged into the unknown, the whispers of the untraveled path beckoning him forward. The trees closed in around him, their branches intertwined like gnarled hands, and for a moment he felt a pang of doubt. That was insane. The storytelling alone makes this a game changer, so you can imagine how narrators will start sweating soon. Now, what about something even bigger, like mental health support? Imagine AI that can actually understand and respond with real empathy to help people, like for example with depression. And I honestly don't know what to do against it. It's incredibly painful to feel alone and unloved. Those feelings can be so isolating, like you're the only one struggling. It takes courage to reach out and admit you're hurting. Have you always felt this way or is this something new? And I honestly don't know what to do against it. It's incredibly painful to feel alone and unloved. Those feelings can be so isolating, like you're the only one struggling. It takes courage to reach out and admit you're hurting. Have you always felt this way or is this something new? Do you hear the difference? Before this model, AI could throw out encouraging words, but the tone was all wrong. Now it actually feels like someone who cares. And that means this could become a real alternative for therapy hotlines and support calls. And talking about support calls, at this point in time, customer support is already solid. But you know what it still sucks at? De-escalating angry customers. Removing first level support calls from human agents has already boosted productivity. But the real game changer is that AI can calm people down by showing empathy. I just want a replacement. Just make it quick, please. I hear you, Yanis. We'll get that replacement tree sent out as quickly as possible. Now, to make sure it gets to the right place, can you confirm your full mailing address for me? So this is the next step. AI that doesn't just answer questions, but actually diffuses tension. And for businesses, that is a goldmine. Not just for better outcome, but happier employees due to less negative phone interactions. So yeah, this, this is huge. And I'm ridiculously excited, not just for what's possible today, 
but because of the underlying tech that is powering it. Sesame just dropped some details on how they pull this off, and you know what's really crazy about this? Some of these concepts have been floating around for years, but no one put them together like this. And like that's not already enough, given the way they describe it on the article, I'm very bullish that we will see not only a super empathic AI in English, but a truly multilingual experience. And there's one specific feature that jumps right out at me, and that is custom voices. In the article, they mention fine-tuning the voice with a two-minute sample over five epochs. For me, that is wild. This could mean we'll soon have AI voices that sound more empathic and natural than we do, maybe even helping us refine our own speech. If that is not a reason to panic before your next public speaking class, what is? Now while Sesame did not release a fully pre-made conversational experience, they did release their speech model, and here's how you can try it. All you need to do is head over to Hugging Face and click on the link in the description of this video. Once you're there and you don't want to customize anything, all you need to do is go down here and click on Generate Conversation, which will generate an audio sample of that conversation that you have in here. Keep in mind that every line is a speaker and the speakers are basically defined up here. If you want to customize them and you want to use your own voice, decide which speaker you'd like to choose. I would preferably just take the first one. You can click here on add your own voice and right within here you can add your audio file sample. For the best experience, I definitely suggest to have the audio example ready as well as the speaker prompt which is basically a transcription of that audio sample. If you don't want to smash your head against the wall with running into errors while generating your voice, make sure that the audio file you upload is mono 44100Hz, has a 16-bit depth and a waveform format. Otherwise, you will see really ugly errors that won't make you happy. Once you uploaded both of them, simply click on Generate Conversation again, and you will see your audio example right down here. And if you're just as hyped as I am, here's something even more exciting that you don't want to miss. Everything we talked about today is just a glimpse of what me and over 1,000 other entrepreneurs and businesses dive in every day inside of our Voice AI Bootcamp. So if you want to use this technology for your own business, or if you're thinking about launching your very own Voice AI agency, then this is where you need to be. Now, it's not cheap. Actually, it's crazy expensive. Because the currency you pay with is your time. But if you are serious about it, if you want to become independent or scale businesses, I'll make sure you have everything you need to succeed. Voice AI is the future, and I want more people in the space, not just watching it happen, but actually shaping it. So hit the link in the description, join the community, and become part of a new movement that will shape the future. Oh, and before you go, where do you see Voice AI in the next 12 months? Drop a comment below and let's talk.